Hi guys, welcome to my channel. If you're new, if you're returning, thank you for coming back. I'm Delaney, for those that don't know. And in today's video, I am going to go over summer 2021 wardrobe staples. So I do a lot of fashion videos on my channel and I like to do a lot of trend videos and discuss the seasonal trends and everything. So I actually already did one of those for summer, but this is more of like a staples video. So it's just all of the things that I need in my wardrobe to style things out for the summer so some of the things in here are more trendy if you're not really like a trendy geared person there is more classic things in here as well and I just wanted to create this as a guide of kind of what you need all together to create the looks for the summer from accessories shoes tops bottoms everything in between I tried to map it all out so don't forget to subscribe and hit the thumbs up if you like this it means so much to me and we also have a sponsor for today's video which is Miss Oma they are one of my favorite jewelry brands I've literally worn their jewelry for years it is such good quality they make really pretty pieces in today's video I'm gonna be highlighting their beaded collection which is so so perfect for summer it's an explosion of nostalgia and joyfulness and happiness and color it's so cute and we are going to be showing you how I style that and everything let's get into the must-haves just gonna dive in with the jewelry and like I said this is about the beaded collection so you guys have probably noticed that beaded jewelry is huge this year It is so cute and it is a perfect expression like I said of joyfulness and happiness nostalgia all those good things I have on here beaded necklaces from Miss Oma and then I also love their chain layering necklaces I've worn those for literally years. They're my go-to to create any kind of like stack of necklaces So I have one of those with a heart pendant and then I also have a half chain half pearl one Which is a recent collection they did as well that I'm obsessed with and it mixes really well with the beads I also have on a couple of beaded bracelets from them, which are super cute I like this little stack because it's kind of dainty But it's still colorful and playful and it definitely makes a statement without being too bold I would say and then I also got two beaded anklets from them, which I think are the cutest thing Anklets are very flattering They make your legs and your feet and the whole look just kind of look seamless and more put together and and I normally just wear like a really plain one like a gold one or something but I love this beaded edition I think that it's extra fun and so good for summer and something that's really fun about this beaded collection is it's gender neutral and if you guys don't know Clayton and I love to share jewelry we love to share clothes so he has a couple of pieces from this collection as well yeah, like one kind of colorful one and then one that is a little bit more neutral but they both are very cool with some little beads gold beads <laughs> we love a guy that rocks jewelry and I think the little pop of color is so good for guys too and it looks so good with like neutral col clothing or colorful clothing so love that it's for everyone I would definitely say for jewelry this summer having some beaded colorful pieces in there is perfect and definitely an essential for any look it's gonna make it just seem more happy and bright and fun and I will link everything from the collection and that we showed in this video in the description box of course since we were just talking about jewelry I'm gonna transition into some more accessories now so next we're gonna talk about bags for the summer a couple of different types of bags on the list for this video but the first is gonna be a beach lake pool just like big encompassing bag that you can put all of your summer needs in like towels books sunscreen snacks water all that good stuff so we actually picked up this giant tote bag beach bag at the flea market the other day and it is so unique and so beautiful we had to have it it's handmade and it's literally huge so uh, this is so perfect for those type of days like I'm saying where you have like towels you have kind of extra clothes maybe extra shoes um, books chargers sunscreen so many things so having like a big bag like this for the summer that's also cute I think is a must-have because you're gonna get so much use out of it and it's very very functional the next type of bag is a tote bag so this is kind of a tote bag it's more like a crossbody tote these have been super trendy all year and I find myself grabbing this bag literally all the time I just got it off Amazon and it's super like slinky and there's a lot of room in it and it's so easy to get things in and out of so I love something like this that is really cute but also again really functional 
traditional. To add on to that, tote bags in general are very trendy this year. Anything like this, a super cute print, um, just like a classic tote bag that goes over the shoulder. It can just be like a canvas one, can be super plain. But these are again really functional and still really cute and trendy right now. So this is a must for putting together summer looks. And the last type of bag that we're going to talk about is something that I love year round but definitely have to include it here because it is an absolute wardrobe staple for me pretty much no matter what season is. But I am definitely a shoulder bag type of girl and my Prada bags tend to be my favorite bags and my most worn. So these are two neutral colored ones. I also have some colorful ones that are perfect for summer but I end up pairing these with most things just because they go so easily. Whatever kind of shoulder bags you like, it doesn't really matter but I just think the style of a shoulder bag is a essential is an essential. <laughs> the next kind of accessory we're gonna talk about is sunglasses. So first, I like to have a pair of rounder sunglasses. These ones are from Movement, and they're just kind of a classic style. Really easy to pair with things. Definitely not on the trendier side, way more safe, I would say. So if that's more your style, this is a perfect kind of shape to go with for glasses. I've had these ones for years. I wear them with so many things and I think that they're just perfect in the summer. I also love a more like square or rectangular pair of glasses. I think that these are a little bit edgier and a little bit more fashionable than the round ones. So if you're going for a look that's a little more dressed up or chic, I think this is a perfect option. These are from the brand Indie Sunglasses, which is a small female-owned business, and I absolutely love them. I also have a code for them, so I'll put that on the screen here. For a more fun, trendy pair of glasses that I honestly get so much wear out of, these are also from Indie Sunglasses, and they are like an aviator-style orange frame, which colored lenses, or orange lenses, and colored lenses are so in the summer, so this is trendier, but it's super cute. I promise it goes with so many things, and it looks good on everything everyone. Uh, Clayton also always steals these glasses from me so these are a good one and I think that the color and everything is perfect for summer. Next accessory is going to be hats. So obviously in the summer you want to protect yourself from the sun. Don't forget to wear your sunscreen and also wearing a hat is perfect because it's going to give you extra protection. If you're at the beach or laying out in the sun it's always really nice to kind of like put the hat over your face fully and take a little rest or something. I talked about this in what we're wearing this summer video as well but trucker hats are huge so just like the little mesh backing and this one is off Amazon it's a little smiley face hat and everybody loves this hat so I had to include it here it's super cute it actually matches so many things and it's very in style right now but it's not too crazy or bold I think everybody looks good in these so definitely some variation of like a cap whether it be just a plain baseball cap or a trucker hat like this is so good for styling summer outfits instead when I'm going for something that's a little more full coverage with the hat I love like a bucket hat situation lately and this one is very wide brimmed which is perfect for the beach or being out in the sun this is from lack of color it's really cute it's just like a fun kind of whimsical print that bucket hat is maybe a little more bold and out there than some people would like to go so it's also great to just have a more neutral option that's a little more classic so this one fits really well and it's also reversible with um, some leopard print inside if you're feeling a little more bold and I actually got this one off Amazon black bucket hat matches virtually everything and looks good on virtually everyone so definitely a good option to have and an essential for styling this summer this isn't actually a hat but it is like a headpiece so a headscarf is so good for summer styling it definitely just gives that luxurious vacation vibe and it's super cute it's something a little different if you're ever feeling uninspired with your outfits or your wardrobe and you want to spice it up a little bit this summer this one is actually a collaboration that my friend Uche did and she sent this to me and it is one of the prettiest scarves I've ever seen and it's also nice and big so this type of scarf you can do multiple things with you can use it as like a little sarong or a top even perfect for summer so now that we've worked through the accessories of the essentials, let's get into the clothing. I'm going to start with bottoms and specifically shorts. Just a pair of good denim shorts that match everything, you feel comfortable in them, they fit well and they're also flattering. This pair is just some good old Levi's and they have
have a little bit of distressing. They're kind of a mid wash and they literally match everything. This is another pair of good denim shorts that I have. It's a little bit lighter of a wash, a little bit of distressing on the bottom again. And these are from Goodnight Macaroon. I wear these in a size small and these are really affordable. So this is a great option as well. They also come in a few different colors. And then I just got a pair of denim shorts custom made from Allie Grace, which is another small female owned business. She gets all of your measurements and literally makes you jeans or shorts that fit perfectly for you and they can be any style. She can distress however you want, all that good stuff. So um, I have a discount code for her as well. If you guys need custom jeans, I'll put that here and a really good option if you have a hard time finding denim that fits you right. And next for shorts, I love a pair of biker shorts in the summer. I actually wear biker shorts all year round and these are from Boyd. I wear these in a size small. They're high-waisted, they fit perfectly, they're super flattering and they're also ethically made. The last category for shorts is gonna be a nice pair of sweat shorts. So I'm just a sweats comfy type of girl no matter what season it is. And since I'm not wearing a ton of sh uh, actual sweats during the summer, I created a pair of sweat shorts. So these are are also from Boyd. I wear these in an extra small small and I end up styling these literally with everything. Perfect going over a bathing suit actually. Super comfy, comfy but they're also lightweight. I love these obviously. I made them so yeah. The next category on bottoms is going to be skirts. So I talk about this skirt so much on my channel. This is my most worn skirt and this style is just a little mini skirt and it has a side slit. I also wear this in every single season. It comes in a million different colors. I wear this in a size US 2, I believe, and it's from Princess Polly. It looks so cute with literally any kind of shoe, sneakers, sandals, boots, literally just anything. This is this is the best skirt. You need the skirt. I wanted to throw in a midi skirt or a longer skirt. I personally don't have any like super long skirts. I like it more of the midi length and I think that this is so perfect for the summer. It definitely screams just like laid back vacation vibes. This one is from Revolve and it has a really high slit so it is a little bit dressier and you can pair these with crop tops. It looks great over a bikini as well and you can dress it up for something if you're going to an event or a date night. So definitely having a little bit of a longer skirt with a little bit of a slit and some personality I think is a great wardrobe staple for styling this summer. All right, and then for pants for summer wardrobe staples, a pair of light wash denim is essential. I know some people don't wear any jeans during the summer, but personally I do, so I wanted to include them. This is one of my favorite pairs. They are from Urban Outfitters, and I size up one size in these because they do run small. I think that the light wash is perfect for the summer. To be honest, I wear these year round as well. You can pair this with anything from just like a loose lightweight button up and a crop top or a big baggy t-shirt. These are perfect to have around. And another style of pant that I think is great for the summer is flares. So you guys know flares have been huge this past year and they're definitely giving me like a nostalgic 90s vibe. These are from Boyd and we created them to be high-waisted, kind of like snatch you in, make sure everything is nice and secure and tight, very flattering, and then they flare out at the bottom. Obviously they're flares and it just creates a really cute look. So I love dressing these down with crop tops, t-shirts, and I also love dressing them up. I've worn them a lot to date nights and things like that recently with heels. So a good option to have and flares are super fun right now You can do patterns on them if you're feeling even more bold I have like a checkered print pair that I love doing that with if you just want something more classic I think a solid black is the go-to next. We're gonna talk about tops for the summer So first is a white tank. I live in white tanks. I need them. They are such an essential for any season, but especially summer. This is ours from Boyd. It is currently sold out. We are working on restocking it for you guys, but any sort of tight ribbed white tank is so good to style with overalls, shorts, denim, skirts, everything and anything. So I'll link a couple of other ones that are available right now for you guys. And this is just a classic. It's a must. It's so easy to throw on with any outfit and you're good to go. Next wardrobe staple for me during the summer is 
graphic tees oversized especially and again this is something I wear every season but it's perfect in the summer if you're like headed to the pool or you've been laying in the sun all day and you just want something like loose and airy to wear but it's not super bohemian or girly like some loose and airy things because as you guys know my store my style gears more towards like a boyish style and just a little bit more casual and laid back so my collection of graphic tees thrives in the summer and I wear some of them as dresses or just throw them over any variation of the bottoms that I just shared. A fun one for a wardrobe staple which is a little bit more trendy right now is a wrap top. So I share these in a ton of videos and I think that they're so flattering on everyone. I don't think you have to have a certain body type to wear this. I literally think it looks good on everyone because there's so many different ways to style these. So this is essentially just a large piece of fabric that you can tie in endless ways and secure the girls in all different ways. And they're really, really cute. They're really fun and they are so summery. So I love pairing these again with kind of any variation of bottoms that I just shared. And I want to have these tops in like every single color because I just have so much fun styling them. And last but not least for a summer wardrobe staple is a button up. So this one is from Boyd and we have this in two colors, white or like a tan color. And this is perfect for so many different occasions I love throwing this over a bathing suit kind of like a cover-up if you're going on a boat or anything like that this is just the perfect piece to pair with it or if you're going out to dinner or an event or something and you want just a little bit of a layer it's really lightweight it's flowy it's classic it's timeless and it matches so many things now we're gonna get into shoes I actually did a video on summer and spring shoe trends which a lot of these styles are featured in but again this video is more geared towards staples and essentials for building the wardrobe for the summer instead of solely focused on trends. First style that I'm going to share with you guys is slides. So I have this pair of foam slides here, um, pillow slides people call them, cloud slides I think. These are so perfect for throwing on with literally everything if you're headed to the beach if you're at the pool if you're going on a walk it's just nice to have a shoe that you can literally slip into without thinking twice about it it takes no effort to put these on and something about that is so valuable to me this style of slide isn't for you any type of slide will do so if you're more of like the classic girl and you want just a really simple slide like a black one or a brown one that's perfect if you want an even more athletic looking slide those are great too. Just have a pair of shoes that you can literally slip into for all of these summer activities and you're going to be so happy and it's going to look right. The next pair of shoes that is essential is flip-flops. So there's lots of variations for this as well. I do have some just like super basic easy flip-flops that you can slide on, but these ones are a little bit more fashionable and they have a little bit of height, which is really nice. I think that this just looks better for my personal style than the completely flat ones that are just super basic that you get at like Old Navy or something. But those are great too and honestly work really well. So whatever your style is, I think think a pair of slides and flip-flops are both solicited for summer essentials. And next, I have to feature a summer sneaker. So I think any really easy white pair of sneakers that you can slip on and is super comfy, pretty plain is a summer essential. I wear a Reebok pair a lot that work for this. Um, also, I have an Adidas pair I love for this, but I am going to feature my Air Force Ones today because this is like my favorite shoe of all time, and I've literally worn these to death. The back heel is actually like raw now, and it's to the plastic like I wore through the shoe part. So I just ordered a new pair of Air Force Ones, um, but these are like so easy to slip into. They are basically the slide version of a sneaker for me. They match everything, they're so comfortable, and like I am an ambassador for the Nike Air Force One for the rest of my life, pretty much. And next, we are gonna feature a heeled sandal. So there's so many variations of this, and kind of just go with whatever suits your personal style best. Maybe that's really strappy, maybe that's kind of like a single strap, whatever works for you. I decided to feature this pair of flip-flop heeled sandals because I've been wearing them so much. They have a square toe, which makes them really edgy and chic. Any very 
variation of a heeled sandal that's kind of neutral and fits your personal style is a wardrobe staple for summer because there's definitely going to be moments where you want to style a heel and dress some things up so make it a fun little flirty sandal last summer shoe that is in my staples is gonna have to be the western boot so this is more on the trendy side but i have found myself styling these so much already they go with everything so i had to include them in this video perfect for throwing on with the denim shorts i mentioned like the white skirt with the slit um even the longer skirt i think this would be really cute sundresses it's perfect which just made me realize i didn't feature any dresses even with bathing suits so don't sleep on the western boot i know that it's a little bit trendy but i feel like anyone can pull it off it really is so easy and i actually got these off of amazon they're so 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 comfortable and they look vintage but they're pretty affordable so love these thank you for watching this video i hope it was helpful if you have any video requests you can always leave them in the comments and i'll see you guys next time